So I'm Gavin Shelton and we're here at CoFarm Cambridge. This is a, a project which is um, the first of its kind in the country looking at a co-farming pilot. Uh, and co-farming really is all about um, bringing people together in communities to uh, relocalise the food system uh, so that it benefits um, our health and our well-being, our local economy, uh, biodiversity and natural capital. Uh, and bringing communities together, so enhancing community cohesion. Um, this site that we're on at the moment is about seven acres um, in Abbey Ward in Cambridge, um, and we're really fortunate to have been supported by the Cambridge Water Pebble Fund um, for a grant which is all about enhancing biodiversity on this site alongside it being very productive for um, food growing as well. We've had about 280 different volunteers involved in um, co-creating the site with us. There are about 300 people who got involved in co-designing the site, so um, it's very much about co-creating a farm with and for a local community. Um, and this is a pilot that we're aiming to scale up across the UK as well, uh, and certainly around Cambridge. So um, this is really very much um, uh, the early days for the, for the project nationally and locally. Hi, I'm Dominic Walsh from Co Farm Cambridge. Um, we were donated money from the Cambridge Water, Water uh, Pebble Fund, and we've spent it on uh, excuse me, we've spent it on um, uh, an orchard, uh, deer proofed around the edges uh, with heritage fruit trees. Altogether, we've planted 117 fruit trees, um, and also uh, sown uh, meadow mixtures all around the site, around the main market garden area. Um, three different main meadow mixtures and then lots of other introduced, introduced um, uh, species from other meadows um, as well as cover crop uh, to, to um, uh, provide for the bees and provide for other insects like hoverflies and uh, beneficial insects which help us grow our, our produce. So my name is James and I'm basically I've volunteered here from a lady that was already part of the project and she thought it would be beneficial for someone like myself to come here and essentially learn about how you raise all these lovely plants that you see here in harmony with everything else that you see really. So you come here and you get to learn about how to look after the ground, I think it might be permaculture, learn a bit of horticulture, a um, bit of botanical information, taxonomy, learning the names of the plants like the agretti over here and the chard and all that other stuff. So it's quite a nice experience to come here a couple of times a week and be out in the nature, hear the birds sing and stuff like that. So it's quite good really. Um, as you might see looking across the site as well, um, we're standing in the market garden zone of the site. So this is where we do the, the majority of the food growing, um, all without the use of any um, fertilize, chemical fertilisers or um, chemical inputs of any kind. So um, we farm in harmony with nature. And you can be incredibly productive that way as well. Um, we've produced about four and a half tonnes of produce from this two acre block, in fact just 0.66 of an acre of it in the first, um, in the first year and um, this year um, we're set to double that to um, about 10 uh, tonnes of produce valued at over £40,000 or so and we're donating all of that as part of the pandemic relief effort to um, nine um, community food hubs across Cambridge City. Um, so it's been a great effort with lots of um, people involved and um, we're really appreciative of the help that uh, the Pebble Fund has given us to um, support biodiversity on the farm here.